Hi, Emily. Hi. My name is Dr. Maddow. I'm going to do your examination today. Great. So when was your last physical? Um, about a year ago. Okay. Mm -hmm. Go ahead and verify your date of birth for me, please. March 2nd, 1999. Do you have any allergies? I do um, pistachios, sunflowers, and okay. um, salmon. And no allergies to medications? No. Okay, do you know your approximate height? 5'7". And approximate weight? Uh, 140. Okay. Are you taking any medications on a daily basis? Yes, just birth control. Okay. For how long have you been taking those? Five years. Okay. Any medical history of hypertension? Mm -mm, no. Okay. Any thyroid problems? Um, my grandma, yeah, she had thyroid problems. Have you experienced any weight changes in the last six months? Mm -hmm. Okay. Any surgeries? Uh, no, just my wisdom teeth. Okay. Any accidents? Um, yeah, just when I was younger, a car crash. But did you hit your head, or I, did you have any broken bones? I did break my arm. Mm-hmm. My right arm. Okay. Any problems after healing? No. It was a good recovery. Okay. So what we're going to do, we're going to take vital signs first. And I'll have you change in this gown and we're going to start the okay. exam. Alrighty. Are you experiencing any numbness or pins and needles in your hands or feet? So, sometimes in my feet before I go to bed for some reason I feel the pins and needles. Okay. Mm -hmm. We'll take a look at your feet as well and check your spine alignment. Right. So for now we're just going to take your blood pressure. Okay. Okay. Go ahead and relax. Okay, blood pressure is a little bit low, 95 over 60. Do you feel dizzy at all? No. Okay, sometimes people just have a low blood pressure and they function properly. Mm. Um, could be a little bit of dehydration. Mm, maybe. I'm going to put this on your index finger. Take your oxygenation. Okay, I'm going to put this on your forehead. Mm. Oxygenation is 95% on room air. Heart rate is 81. Blood pressure was 95 over 65. Okay. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and have you lay down and I'll start by examining your face and your neck, okay? Okay. Okay, Emily, I'm going to start by palpating your prior 
regular lymph nodes, okay? We're feeling for any small lumps. Sometimes they could be the size of a pencil diameter. Mm. But everything feels good. And then post auricular lymph nodes. Not feeling anything enlarged. Supplemental. Under the chin. And here we could also feel salivary glands. Not feeling anything abnormal. Okay, go ahead and swallow for me. Good. Not feeling the thyroid gland, which is expected. Trig is midline. Feeling a roll on the right side. And under the right mandible, it could be just a tensed muscle. Sinuses above the eyebrows feel normal size, nothing swollen there. I'm going to check your sinuses below your eyes. a few tests here. I'm going to have you keep your eyes closed as much as you can. I'm going to try to open them, okay? Okay. Okay, good. And go ahead and lift your eyebrows up. I'm going to try to push them down. Don't let me do that. Okay, relax. And go ahead and clench your jaw. Good. Unclench. All right. Everything was symmetric. I'm going to check for any popping sounds when you open your mouth. So I'm going to have you slightly open your mouth. And now open it all the way. Very good. And close it slowly. Wonderful. There are no, no sounds there. to palpate your mastoid bone behind your ear. Anything tender or swollen here? Mm -mm. Okay. Feels normal size. Looking at the hairline, there's normal hair distribution, some alopecia here on the left and right upper side of the cranium. And we're going to look throughout the scalp area for more symptoms like that. 
I'm gonna have you smell this and please tell me what what it smells like. Mm, eucalyptus. Okay, mm, so now it's lavender. Mm. And I'm going to put one drop on your tongue. You can go ahead and open your eyes. And tell me what this tastes like. Strawberries. Mm. Okay. All right. I'll take a few measurements. Go ahead and lift your head up for me and put it back down. Lift it one more time. Thank you. Go ahead and put it back down. Okay, can you please tell me if you feel this equally on left and right? Yes, I can. Tell me when you don't feel the vibration. Do you feel it equally on both sides? Mm -hmm. Tell me when it stops. It stopped. Okay, slide it right there. Can you please tell me if you feel this equally on both sides? Yes. 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 Okay. Go ahead and tell me if you feel this sharp or dull. Sharp. Dull. Sharp. 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 Dull. 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 Sharp. Okay, I'm going to have you open your eyes and cover your left eye with your left hand. Can you please grasp the Snellen chart and extend your arm all the way? Go ahead and read the last row starting with the first letter to the left. All right. L-T-F-P-H. Okay, and now switch eyes. And your arm all the way. Perfect. Read the last letter from the right to left. H P F T L. And what color is here? Red. And the other one? Green. Okay, good. Perfect. Take a look at your scalp. Can you tell me if this feels sharp or dull? Sharp. 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 Okay. Do you feel this sharp all the way? Yes. Does it feel sharp or dull to you? And is this cold or warm? Mm, kind of warmer. What about now? Cool. And now? Cool.
Okay. Does this feel sharp or dull? Sharp. 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 And did you feel that equally on all three sides? Yes. What about now? Dull. Dull. And is this warm or cold? Warm. Cool. Okay. Is it sharp or dull? Does this feel sharp or dull? Is this sharp or dull? Okay. What about now? Does this feel sharp all the way? Oh, ah, uh, sharp. And is it sharp or dull? Dull. Is this warm or cold? Mm, warm. Sharp. Dull. Sensory loss, it's very serious. It's an indication of a neurological impairment. So go ahead and tell me if you feel this sharp or dull. Dull. Okay. What about now? Sharp. Very good. Alright, so on this side looks good. Let's go ahead and check your left side. Okay, I'm gonna have you tell me if you feel this sharp all the way down. Yes. Okay. And does this feel cold all the way down? Yes. And is this sharp or dull? We're going to go ahead and check your back now. Okay. Okay, Emily. Are you comfortable? Yes. Super comfortable. Okay. I'm going to start by palpating your neck area. Okay. Posterior. Feeling also for any occipital lymph nodes. But also noticing the curvatures of your spine. Mm. I'm noticing slight redness. Mm. 
thoracic area is normal, not feeling any pulsations around the spine. No signs of scoliosis or lordosis, normal curvatures. Take some measurements for checking for any inflammation, asymmetry. Light elevation of the scapula on the right side. But everybody's different. It's just a variation, not necessarily abnormal. <laughs> Any numbness along the spine? <clears throat> Nothing. Kind of us. Let me know if you feel any pain. Okay. Mm. I'll tap on your spine. We're looking for any abnormal reflexes. In there. Mm -hmm. Okay, I would like to look deeper into that area and see exactly why it's hurting you. Yeah. So first, I will assess level of inflammation. We're looking for a blanching edema. This is a pinching test. So just light pinching and then releasing. Can you feel the vibration? Mm-hmm. Go ahead and tell me when you don't feel it anymore. I don't feel it anymore. What about now? It stopped. It stopped. Okay, normal neurological conduction. Go ahead and tell me if you feel this on the left or right. Uh, right. Left. Both. 
Did you feel that equally on both sides? Mm -hmm. Right. Left. Both. One is going to feel sharp. This is what sharp is going to feel like. And the other one is going to feel dull. This is what dull is going to feel like. Okay. okay. So go on and tell me if you feel sharp or dull. Mm -hmm. Sharp. Check your legs and your feet now. Okay. okay. Have you noticed any swelling on your legs? Uh, no. No swelling. Do you have DVTs in your family? No, I don't. Your parents, grandparents. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm going to slide my hand under your. Go ahead and relax this one. And I'll just slightly lift this and I'll palpate your calf. Feeling for any edema, anything swollen. Good. Same thing on the other side. as well. Looking for anything that's raised. measurements here. I'm going to check the circumference of each leg. 
looking for any asymmetry, which would be a sign of indication of slight swelling or fluid retention. Okay, they are equal in size, which is normal. Going to palpate your legs and your feet. Normal temperature, bilaterally. And locating now pedal pulses. Peripheral circulation. We're going to check a capillary refill within three seconds. Perfect. Okay. Now I'm going to have you relax your foot. Very good. And I'll slide the um, hammer across the sole of your foot. To elicit a neurological response, we're checking your Papinski reflex now. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Go ahead and tell me if you feel this sharp or dull. Okay. Sharp. Sharp. And did you feel that equally on both sides? Yes. Dull. Dull. Sharp. Sharp. Dull. I'm going to touch you with two pointy objects. So it's going to be two in the same time or only one. This is what two is going to feel like. Okay. And this is what one is going to feel like. Mm -hmm. Okay, so go ahead and tell me if you feel two or one. Four. Two. Does this feel cold or warm? Cool. Cold or warm? Warm. What about now? Warm. And now? Warm. Okay. Go ahead and tell me when you don't feel the vibration anymore. Stop. Wonderful. Alright, so we finalized the examination. I'm gonna have you sit up and we'll talk to the results. Alright, I'm just going to remove my gloves here. So this was a normal head to toe physical exam and next time we're gonna have to do a vision check. We skipped that uh, definitely because you were laying down but we can definitely have you referred to an ophthalmologist to check your vision. Okay. All right. Sure. I did not see any deficiencies. I don't think you need any um, further testing, so that's a good sign. Yeah, great. Do you have any questions for me? No, no questions, doctor. All Thank right. you. Thank you as well for coming in mm -hmm. and for allowing me to do this exam on you. Of course. Thank you.